Hey guys, welcome to Kaushik Blogs. I'm so sorry I did a mistake of not putting uploading videos. Now, today I'm going to talk about my HP Pavilion 14 long term review. So, let's see, let's go to system information. Oh wow, that's cool. Mm, let's see. Okay, so now system info, let's go, sorry. Yeah, system information, look at that. Now, everything is good. <clears throat> OS name, Microsoft Windows, Windows Home, this is. And in Indian rupees, I spent 66,000. This is HP Pavilion 14. And now let's see. Uh, okay. HP Pavilion 14, DB XS44, system type x64 based, and uh, processor is 12 gen. Oh, i5, i5 and 12th generation. and uh, yeah okay so, so now coming to its physical overview it's very nice i like it it's come metal with polycarbonate body and the audio is superb as you can hear see look at the stereo mics i'm speaking left and right and left and right and right and left everything is fine 3.5 jack is given usb ports i think um one two ports two ports are there and one is for memory card and one is for charging and one is for hdmi that's really cool and um, speakers two speakers that's really awesome stereo speakers and um, what is that we have a fingerprint sensor guys wow it's so cool actually it's really awesome for a blind perspective we can easily get to know where is the fingerprint that is next to down arrow the small box type you can keep your finger and now so after that after that this charging it comes around four hours for me uh, four hours charging for me and one major disadvantage is the fan sound when it's getting updated it's Ooh, that's a strange sound you know and coming to its pricing it's good coming to its audio quality in the movies wow it's so cool and the boot time it's less than 15 seconds it turns on that's awesome that's really awesome and coming to hp service wow that's really superb and coming to audio quality in hp about screen readers like nvidia and jaws wow it's really awesome 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 i can't say more than that and um, coming to this uh, disadvantages the fan sound and uh, gaming experience it's it's 98 percent that's i will not give you 100 percent but 98 percent it's good and uh, <clears throat> the keyboard in the laptop keyboard and this is a just a little bit of tight but i tell you don't ever try to use for gaming okay that's really cool there is no numpad keys in it because it's a 14 inch laptop and there is no touchpad touch screen sorry so rest of the things is really awesome and my honest opinion finally is go for hp pavilion 14. it's easily compatible comfortable portable whatever you can say it's easily carryable you can carry anywhere in the world and um, there's a disadvantage from hp store they didn't give me the bag the stupid guys they didn't give me the bag I got for 66,000 oh dear they didn't give me the bag and the charger quality is awesome I like it seriously so go for HP Pelvin 14 if you're visually impaired or sighted around if you're looking around 60 to 70,000 go for it thank you thank you thank you